children of the world. Red, brown, yellow, black, and white, all are precious in His sight. Jesus died and rose for children of the world. Hello, children. Welcome to day 17 of listening to God's word from the devotional series, Kids Draw the Bible, helping you get the big picture. Before we begin our devotion, let us look to God in prayer. Join your hands, close your eyes, bow your head. Gracious Lord, our most loving Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. Speak to us from your word, O Lord. Teach us what you want us to learn. Help us to listen carefully, understand and apply to our lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today's devotion is titled, Jesus and the Children. Children, do you ever feel you're too young? There are some things you cannot do if you are very little. Coming to Jesus is something you can do even if you are too young. Many people wanted to be around Jesus. They always spend their time talking and listening to Jesus. One day, many parents brought their children to Jesus because they knew Jesus was God the Son and they wanted Jesus to bless their children. But the disciples were not happy. The disciples thought Jesus had many important things to do. So the disciples scolded the people and told the people to put their children away. But when Jesus saw what happened, he was very, very angry. Let's read what Jesus told the disciples. Children, if you have your Bibles with you, please turn your Bible to Mark chapter 10 and verse 14. Children, this is your memory verse and I want you to read this verse along with me. Mark chapter 10 and verse 14. But when Jesus saw it, he was greatly displeased and said to them, Let the little children come to me and do not forbid them, for of such is the kingdom of God. Mark chapter 10 and verse 14. Children, the Bible says Jesus was very displeased with what the disciples did. He told them, Let the children come to me, do not forbid them, because Jesus loved the children very much and Jesus loves you too. You can talk to him anytime, children. He is never too busy for you and you are never in his way. He wants you to spend your time with him. He wants you to tell him all that is happening in your life. Many people around you might not have time for you, but remember, children, Jesus is waiting for you. He wants to hear from you and he is always there for you. And that is what Jesus did. When the children came to him, he took them in his arms and he blessed them. Let's talk about this, children. I will ask you three questions. I want you to think about the answers and give the answers to your family members or to your siblings or even to your friends. And the first question is, why did the parents bring the children to Jesus? I want you to write it down in your notebook and draw a picture of Jesus and the children in your notebook. Children, you can look at the screen. You will find a picture of Jesus and the children with children like you have drawn in their notebooks. Get an idea from it and you can draw it in your notebook. And the second question is, why was Jesus angry? And the third question is, what are some of the things that you can talk to God? I want you to make a list of it and talk to God today. And remember children, Jesus is always there for you and he is waiting for you. You can talk to God right now. Join your hands, close your eyes, bow your head. You can begin your prayer by saying, Dear Heavenly Father, and thank God that He loves you so much that He is waiting for you. Ask God to help you to spend your time with Him. And you can end your prayer by saying, In Jesus' name, Amen. Shall we pray? Gracious Lord, our most loving Heavenly Father, we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, that you love us so much and you love the children very much. Thank you, Lord, that you never forbid the children from coming to you. You always wanted the children to be with you. Thank you, Lord, that you love them very much and that they can spend their time with you. Help the children, O Lord, to spend their time with you and to enjoy their time with you, O Lord. We give you all glory, honor, praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Children, if you are blessed by today's devotion, you can share this video with your friends and relatives so that they will be blessed and they will know that Jesus loves the children very much and that they can spend their time with Jesus. God bless you children. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.